Yeah, I'm talking about you. Shiva banana. Shiva. Say hi, everybody. Yes, yeah, she's a very big girl. <clears throat> you gonna work on some tilde cards, huh? You work on some tilde cards? Okay, here's Miss Shiva. Look how big she is. 45 pounds, the doctor said today. Good girl, sit down. That's yours. What you gonna do with it? It's a bark box. Oh, she's gonna eat it. <laughs> she is gonna eat it. No, no, no. This is, this is daddy's tool to open the bark box. <laughs> <coughs> Shiva. Shiva, come here. Shiva. Say hi, everybody. My name is Shiva Banana. Shiva Valani. Okay, you want to open it? Look. Here, open it. Here, open it. Push it open. Push it open. <laughs> what do you got? What kind of goodies do we have for you? Dear family, I'm up at a forward fire base called LG somewhere out You got some the, the snack rain. Let me see. That's it's like they're they're doing it all in, in like Halloween stuff. Oh. <laughs> To save the treats for when she feels better. Yeah. Oh, a new toy? Oh, look at look. <laughs> oh, a new toy. Like we don't have enough of those already. Oh, I like that one. Let me see it. <laughs> they give ugly toys. <laughs> This one's got a weird... This one doesn't... Here, check this one out. It feels hard. What's the story with that one? <coughs> Ghost Squirrel Finder. Oh, look. Shiva. Here, put this on. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the ghost <coughs> squirrel? <coughs> No, we don't eat this. All right, so we're all good. We seen the bark box this time. Yeah, it fits the it fits the, uh, the theme. The theme, yeah. Okay. Well, I need the box because I got to send cards out tomorrow. Lady bought all my cards. Okay. All right, Chief. Are you happy? Are you a happy girl? Guys, it's Thursday. Thursday, and I haven't vlogged all week. And it's been kind of crazy with Shane here. <clears throat> and um, honestly, I got to be honest, uh, the second Walking Dead episode I found very, very, very good. So I've been listening to lots of podcasting and uh, chats about Walking Dead. So kind of got off track with vlogging. Did you ever get like where somehow a piece of the inside of your gums like goes in and it like keeps getting stuck in your teeth and it hurts. <clears throat> Shiva, get down. Get down. Get down. <laughs> Got the zapper. Say hi to everybody. Hi everybody. Yeah, the people came to put up the building early and he was like, I made the bed and opened the curtains. He's like, well, I guess I'm up now. <laughs> um, so the cleaning lady is going to be here in 15 minutes. And, yeah, I got to talk to him. I'll be back. Okay, That's taken care of. Anyway, so last night, the cleaning lady messages me and says, see you tomorrow. And I'm just like, oh, my God. 
much shame stuff is everywhere. I forgot honey was even going to be home today. So I didn't think about that. And then this morning I woke up and I was like, oh crap. So I messaged her and I told her, I was like, I'm not going to cancel on you, but this is what's going on. I'll move all the boys stuff into the office. You won't have to clean the office. My husband's here. He doesn't like to get up early. So if you could start at the kitchen and, uh, and, and my new girl, my new girl, whom I said was doing well and I thought was doing well, quit showing up. I messaged her on Monday and I was like, see you tomorrow at nine. And she said, gotcha. And then she never showed up. And I messaged her five times throughout the day on Tuesday. I hope you're okay. I hope everything's all right. She never showed up. She never messaged. She never, wouldn't answer her phone. She didn't call. And yesterday, same thing, nothing. <clears throat> so, and then Miss Sheba Banana here got sick. She had diarrhea on Saturday. <clears throat> And I just thought, ah, oh, just a, you know, no big deal. And then <coughs> Sunday night, she woke me up four times to take her to the bathroom. Hey, stop. So I took her to the vet. Stop. Oh, this must not be working. No. She's in the house because Honey's thinking she's going to be barking at the guys, building the building, because they are out there building the building. Goodbye. There she goes. <coughs> anyway. So, new girl gone. Um, had two working interviews yesterday. One girl... was very, uh, she had a little bit of experience. She had worked at a boarding kennel where they did baths and stuff. And she did pretty well. She was a little like foo-foo-y with the dogs. And it was like, oh no, ain't got, ain't nobody got time for that. It's not time to play with the dogs. It's time to get them groomed and get them done and send them home. So that was our only issue with her. <clears throat> And then the other lady, no experience whatsoever, but had been self-employed all her life. Let me tell you, from someone who's been self-employed, it's kind of hard to go to work for somebody else. I struggled with that um, <clears throat> for about four years when I first moved to Colorado. Um, I was lucky that I did have an employer that respected my opinions but it still was kind of hard so anyway um i opted to go with the girl with some experience and her name is destiny which is savannah's middle name which is kind of weird but it'll be okay so <coughs> anyway yeah so far it's been a crazy week but the building is going up they're out there they're doing it I have to leave early because without the new girl, um, the new girl starts Saturday. So uh, without the old girl, Amy's actually coming to help us today, but still. Today we have the five cockers in full coat that belong to the lady who doesn't mind paying anything that we charge her. <coughs> so I have to go early too. Um, The Thanksgiving holiday week, let's see, we're at the 18th. So one, two, three, four. About four weeks from today is when Thanksgiving craziness will start at the shop. So. A little bit nervous. I've never had a new person this close to the holiday. We've always hired somebody and they've, you know, we've had time to get them trained. So, um, yeah, a little bit nervous. But I think I'm going to do a lot of vlogging today from the shop. I want you guys to see those five beautiful cockers and which one might be the daddy to Rizzo's babies. Yeah. 
Okay, time to get some more tea. Cleaning lady should be here in 10 minutes. Crazy, 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 honey, Tom. Cleaning lady, people putting up buildings. Ah! So our building is actually our smaller building. It's going up over there. Honey's going to bring the fence this way. When are you going to do the fence? When is that on your, ASAP. like, next week, this coming weekend kind of thing? Probably, maybe. Because we're going to have really good weather. Yeah. We've got two cars of the boys. We've got my truck. We've got Honey's Jeep. We've got the cleaning lady is here. It's chaos. All right, we'll see it when we get home. Honey's going to go get paint, and it could possibly be painted when I get back. Get back. Depends on me, don't you? I have a lot of dogs. You'll be painted when you get back. Okay. Oh, I thought you could see these better. Didn't seem like there was much glare when I walked in. So, these are our front windows. You really can't see that. Down here is better. It's a little bathtub with a little dog in it. Only one person said anything about my new sign. I love it. And then they came and they put up the doggy daycare and home pet sitting, pet grooming, and wash and go service. Trick or treat, little dog with a witch hat. Let's go in, you can see our, our tree better. with the hat. All right. There's my two beautiful vintage pieces. I can't wait to start working on those. Look at all these cards, guys. Somebody needs to buy up these cards. I'm going to have to do a de-stash. And then I made this banner a couple years ago. We hang that up every year. This is how it looks when you walk in. Dogs are not our whole life, but they make our lives whole. And I love that. I made that. Dog hair is just part of the decor around here. And that. Our DVD player is not working. I'm going to have to get a new one. And I bought this off of um, Facebook Marketplace. I think he's so cute. And he holds our no-show fee sign. Halloween bandanas are starting to dwindle a bit. No Disney today? I don't know, Jeff, you had that computer before, I think. I will, I will give it to you. That's one of the cockers. Okay, guys, here's cocker number one. This is Jilly. Hi, Jilly. Hi, Jilly. Jilly is, um, has the least amount of hair of all of the five cockers. So I told Savannah since she would be the easiest to get ready for me to do her first. And whoever was doing her, oh my gosh, she's not supposed to have like a pom-pom on her head. You guys will see what she's supposed to look like after. They came way too low on the ears. <clears throat> yeah. She's going to look like a new woman. Aren't you, Jilly? <laughs> hey, here she is. Say hi, Jilly. Say, I look like a cocker now. Yes, I do. Look at her feet. Woo, pretty feet. What a pretty girl you are, Jilly Jilly. Yeah, I hope her mom is real happy. So that's... Cocker number one. This is Chloe. Hi, Chloe. Chloe, are you a pretty girl? You know your name, don't you? Chloe. <laughs> All right. So this is Chloe's before. Here's Chloe again. Uh, you look very good. Uh, other things with their life. Uh, they are um, 
they're, they're, they're going to say, you know what, maybe that high donor one team can wait a little bit. I'm going to shake hands with these guys uh, because they're they're certainly uh, devoting a lot of time um, um, for the vice president. Sorry, we're just being told to, to move a little tighter than the vice president. Perhaps okay, guys, now we've got Seamus. Seamus, you know your name too. Seamus is a champion. And he's a good boy. His name is, is your name good boy? Um, so he's retired, sort of. But um, yeah. This is Seamus before. Okay, here's Seamus. He's all done. You all done, Seamus? Look at his pretty feet. Seamus, you look beautiful. Stand up. <laughs> Gorgeous. And this is Rizzo's potential boyfriend. Hey guys, I'm home. Look what we've got. <coughs> and honey already painted it. Good job, honey. Well, let's go inside. <coughs> Look at the back side. Here's the back. Wow. Yeah, it looks better without green doors. <laughs> I was, you know, I was going to give you the option. If you still want them, I can certainly do it. Oh, you're going to have to build a step. Oh, I know. How it's dead bolted in. Oh, okay. Oh! Wow, it's a nice size, don't you think? I do. I'm glad we added the two extra feet. Yeah. It doesn't look like there'll be a lot of storage in the ceiling, though. I, I was thinking there might be storage in the ceiling. Yeah, we can, we can certainly do some things. Yeah, but... Yay! Hey guys, it's Friday morning. I remembered it was Friday, because Friday... <laughs> Honey always asks for his allowance. He's like, it's Friday, can I have my allowance? <laughs> That's how I remembered it was Friday, because he just left. <clears throat> I've been really trying to make some cards for the last few days and struggling, struggling because somebody told me my cards were beautiful and I had more talent in my little finger than most people do, but all my cards are the same. Do something different, they say. It will be fun, they say. Makes me struggle, but my audience has spoken. And I have listened. So I'm going to make some. It's not like I've never made these before. But <clears throat> I am making something different. Um, in addition to that. I've been struggling. Because we've been super busy at the shop. And down one person. But I did hire someone. And she starts Saturday. I may have mentioned that already. So that's good. And the building came yesterday and got installed and got painted and now it's time to put in shelves and electric and lights and yeah so excited um honestly i'm really glad we decided to get that building up first and get that finished like set up and everything before the other one comes um because the other one honey has to finish it out inside like a house it has to look beautiful because that's where people are going to shop and where we're going to take our photos of our stuff and all of this. So that brings me to another conversation, <clears throat> which is I'm not going to stop this, but there's going to be a lot less of this. And I guess a lot of it is going to be really honey doing stuff, getting it you know, he's got to put in the shelves. He's got to do the electrical. He's got to do the insulation, blah, blah, blah. But once that stuff is done, then it's time for me to go in and organize. Oh, we've got to get, I mean, I already have a whole bunch of totes. Um, we're going to store different items. Um, 
but you know, we're going to have to get pegboard and hang the tools and, you know, um, order the paints and organize the paints and, you know, just a lot of my kind of stuff, which <clears throat> means I'll be able to stay doing this for a while, but then there's probably going to be a lull and I'm a little disappointed because it's hitting right about when Christmas stuff is happening. I've got to decorate the house. Oh my gosh, so much to do. So much to do. But I'm excited about all of it. My back is really giving me trouble this week because it's weird. But I'm going in at 10 instead of at 12. But that's two extra hours of grooming, which is my back is just like by the time I get off, it's like. So. Uh, fortunately, Amy has been coming. She came Wednesday, Thursday, and she will be there today. And then we're on our own <coughs> Saturday, but we have a new girl on Saturday. So, good Lord willing, we'll make it through the holidays. So, anyway, I just thought I'd come and have a, a little chat this morning. I have to call my BFF. She called me early. It's 7.13 now. Oh, and I have a phone meeting with my accountant on Monday morning about the new business because that is going to totally be set up as a business. Um, you know, we got to do the sales tax. We got to do the federal withholding. You know, we got to do all of the stuff. And there's a lot to getting a business going. <laughs> I told, it's when I sent her an email, I told her, I was like, it's been a lot of years since I started a business and I need some guidelines, some directions. Are there any new stuff I have to do? So the name of the business officially is Vintage Stuff and Bangs. Yes, Thangs. And if you don't remember, Thangs, T-H-A-N-G-S, is the way Rick, Andrew Lincoln from The Walking Dead, says things. He doesn't say things. He says things. So <clears throat> that's going to be our little mash of bringing the walking dead into our business. All right, guys, I better go. I need to call my BFF back. I've got to make myself another cup of tea because this one is empty. Somebody asked me what kind of tea it is. It's Bigelow. Bigelow tea and it's toasted coconut. That's my favorite. And I promise on Monday, I'm going to go through the last several vlogs and do comments. Maybe I'll do it on Sunday. Yeah, because I'm going to need some material for vlogging. <laughs> so I will see you guys either Sunday night or Monday morning with the next vlog. Bye. Hey guys, guess who's here in her kiss shirt and her witch hat? <laughs> <laughs> she's been out watching tv and she just started coming in here and playing with all my little knickknackies and digging in my halloween drawers yeah, <laughs> yeah. <coughs> this is what's going on on my table but it's almost time for me to go <laughs> but she's got Teddy coming to hang out with her and she loves Teddy, right? Yeah. And look at this scary thing. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's definitely grandma's spooky drawer. <laughs> All right. Funny. Tell everybody. See you. Bye bye.